it's such an amazing time. You have this amazing opportunity right now to connect to what's true. And what's true is only what's right here. It's not what your mind is thinking about and anticipating in the future. It's not a thing that you had to go through from the past. The memory of it might exist, but it's not something you have to keep fighting. Instead, only what's here is true. Your heart's beating, the space is here, and it's just full of worthiness, love, magic, and it's asking you to stop being identified as the pattern that you've created to protect yourself from feeling trauma again, right? There's trauma in the body, then there's the achiever you became, the codependent, the avoidant, whatever. None of that's you. If you wanna really change the planet, connect to what's real right here. Connect to the space that's right here. We have identified ourselves as these characters. And then we say, I am an achiever. I am this story. I am a victim, whatever. It's wrong. And life will dismantle that and it'll be death to you because you think that's you and it's not. Life is asking you to choose today to connect to what's real. When you start listening to this energy right here for a while, you will purge these old patterns. And then you'll start to see from a much bigger lens. And seeing is alchemizing. And when you alchemize the stuff in your body, you start to watch as the world does the same. And the chaos you're seeing in the world is the fall apart of everyone's false self and their defense of that. They're trying to keep holding on to something that's not them. It'd be like if you had something dead under your house. Well, obviously something dead under your house is going to start making a smell. There's gonna, it's just gunk comes up. We need to clean that out or the smell's gonna get worse. But imagine if you wouldn't let us get that out. You're like, don't, don't go under there. I'm like, it's just gonna smell worse, man. You're just, it's gonna be up and you're like, no, don't. That's us. We're like, don't look at my trauma. Don't look at my abuse. Don't look at my childhood. Don't look at my fear. Don't look at my abandonment. I am the avoidance of that. No, you're not. We gotta clean that out. And God is cleaning everything out. God's cleaning the gunk out in you. God's cleaning the gunk out in every person. And if you're fine with that, if you participate with that, if you say, I choose this experience, I choose to work, now you're working with God. If you say, this can't happen, this is the worst thing, whatever life's giving you right now that you can't control and it's the worst thing, you're now arguing with God. But if you let God, remove what doesn't align with you anyway. And then the, the patterns and the traumas that come up that are the crap that's under the house so that it can be alchemized, so you can see it, so that it can leave. You're changing the planet. And God goes, hey, there's a bunch of dead animals under everyone's house and I'm getting them all out. There's a reason that makes that smell. There's a reason why something that's hidden makes us smell. Isn't this crazy? So there's a lot of smells coming up, but some people are willing to look at it and their houses are getting cleaner and they're getting freer. And there's some people fighting. Don't look under this. Don't look under here. You can go down with this issue. You can fall with the issue or you can open your heart and let what's not you be removed. And that's the split in the world right now. Some people are like open and it's speeding up the collective consciousness and we are getting too light. We see too much, we're too bright. Darkness can't work in this field. And next year, even more, and next year it's gonna exponentially move faster that it's just too light for darkness to work anymore. We're collectively getting the crap out from under our houses. It's painful, especially if you argue with that it's happening. So my dare is open your heart, get present, get here. Know that everything's on schedule, everything's perfect, and connect to the space, because this is what's true. This is you. The trauma that you don't want people to see isn't you. The blocking of the trauma isn't you. The story, I'm an achiever, I'm a procrastinator, all those things, I'm a worrier. It's not true, you're now, you're infinite possibility. Start the process of connecting to it, participating with it, listening to it, and it'll purge what's not you. And then watch as the world mirrors that. Thank you.